Okay. <laughs> I am back. So I should also tell you that I'm sure you don't want to see my ugly leg, but I mentioned I was crawling. I'm a very independent person. I have a very hard time sitting still. This cast is not supposed to be like this, but uh, I have fallen several times, four times yesterday. And this is the knee I put on the knee scooter to help me get around. And I fell off my knee scooter and it is very tender. Um, so, you know, I am clumsy. So it's a pain to get around. I just crawled to my bedroom, got out my bag of diapers. One of the sets that I purchased came in this nice little bag. Um, and my, this, this set didn't come in the bag. I bought this separately. And actually, I think it was, um, I don't remember Katie's channel. The one, Katie, who has Charlie and Tio and Julian, she um, introduced me to this diaper. And I absolutely adore this. Um, so anyway, I, I felt like I wanted to put this one on uh, little Reagan today. Um, I think, yeah. I have several other options, just the covers, because clearly there's no waste going in there, right? So, um, this is going to be really interesting. I'm going to try to sit my, oh, is this going to work? Oh, okay, well, I may have rigged it up. I enjoy watching people change their babies, which seems strange, um, I think, maybe not, uh, so I hope you do too. If not, let me know. Hopefully I'll have some subscribers and get some feedback. If you think I'm awful and need to just lay down in bed until my leg, <laughs> till my leg heals, um, that would be great. I understand that. I'm not going to be offended. Uh, I am a, just let you know, I'm a social worker by profession. I am a supervisor in child welfare. I am on family medical leave due to my recent surgery, but that's what I do and that is my background. Um, that job keeps me very, very busy and um, is emotionally draining sometimes. So it is nice. To, I have been looking for a hobby um, for quite some time. And I know, please don't cringe. I know a lot of people don't like her hair is rooted very well, but I think people are worried about hair falling out. But anyway, I will try to be more careful. I don't want to freak people out. Oh, gosh, sorry. Um, so anyway, very excited to be, to have some time off. This is a good time for self-care, uh, nurturing baby dolls. And again, I am aware that these are not real. These are baby dolls uh, for role play. Um, but again, this is my Lulu sculpt who is for sale. Um, I anticipate I will take a loss on her, which I'm ready to do. One of the things that I've noticed about me, what's behind you, babe? Oh, um, on eBay is that I tend to get pretty competitive when bidding, if that makes sense. I don't know, should I put the orange one on? Or the ballerina one, I don't know. Does it really matter because it's gonna be covered up? Probably not. I also have this um, cupcake one, which is kind of cute. But this one, for some reason, is my, I don't know why, it's, it's my favorite. It's by TGQ Kids. Um, I just love that pattern. So anyway, um, I'm gonna do ballerinas because she's got her ballerina lovey. Now, good, okay, <laughs> thought I misplaced it. Okay, so, and I've, I don't know what you guys do with these diapers, but some of these um, come, and do you like my fake nails, by the way? Uh, um, these are press-on nails. My boyfriend bought me, I swear, every kind that there is. Very sweet, because he knew I wasn't gonna get my nails done. But anyway, I've cut the liners out. I don't know if anyone else does that. These liners were attached to the diaper, inside the diaper. Um, obviously, these babies don't wet. 
um, like our cloth body. But Lulu is so sweet and I think looks adorable in this ballerina diaper. Okay, where did your passy fill out? I am so sorry. Um, okay, where's the other side? So, anyway, where was I? Um, hmm. No, I haven't really mastered these diapers yet. To me, when I first got them, it was just, I don't know if I quite understand them. Maybe somebody can help figure them out for me. I don't know. Um, so just be kind. <laughs> I'm trying to work my way through this. Um, can you even see? I don't even know, and I'm apologizing. I don't have professional equipment. Um, so did you all see the... Romy Stridum baby doll that went up. The blonde haired, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful baby. Um, she is a talented artist indeed. Um, unfortunately, that is not in my price range. Uh, I am now have decided right for right now today. Remy, I believe, will be my but will be my only um, vinyl sculpt. I, I'm not saying forever. Um, I would like to have some, some, some silicones. Silicones, I think, is where I think I would be most happiest with, um, in collecting. Um, and I've ordered, like I said, I've had one, one I just ordered, I think, for some reason, I ordered it on PayPal and paid with my bank account, so the funds it's like a check having to go through so hopefully it said it could be up until the the 16th until the funds are cleared 17th which i certainly hope not but if it's the case i will wait i meant to have it charged first to my credit card and i think that's what makes the difference but anyway um and then again like i said i have a custom order um that is actually from ellie's babies um, and I think she's from the UK or Australia. I can't remember. It is the Adler sculpt. Um, and I can't remember who the sculptor is. But if you want to look that up, you can see her. She is sold. But she is going to be mine, but not until March or April. And I did not want to wait until March or April. Um, because I am impatient. <laughs> uh, and I, I did bid on, oh gosh. It was, the doll's name was Janie, and I can't remember which YouTuber I had seen her on before. Really good price for that, for that sleeping baby, but I did not win. I almost did. I blame my, my, my significant other boyfriend. He, he was distracting me with, I don't know what, but I was the highest bidder and then lost at the last second. But anyway, the one I have coming, like I said, is, uh, the, the nursery, I guess, or the, the, it's called Miracles of Mine. I, um, I can't remember her first name and I'll, and I'll get that, get that later if anyone's interested, but she, um, she sculpts her own babies and paints them and roots them. So I really have a lot of respect for an artist who does that. And she sells them at, you know, a much more reasonable price, um, three to $4,000 even six to eight is, is doable. Um, I am not going to be able to justify ever spending, well, never say never, right? <laughs> um, spending that, uh, you know, a Romy Stridum price, like $20,000. Um, with that being said, one day I hope perhaps I may have one of her dolls in my collection. Um, Another one I'd like to have is a Claire Taylor doll. There are several on, can you even see this right now? Am I, here we go. I don't want to ruin it here. There are several on eBay right now, and I believe it's the Tate sculpt. One is the female Tate, and the other is the male. And the male, I think, is biracial or African American. Both are beautiful dolls. I honestly have considered purchasing those babies. Um, even as I'm waiting for my Dixie from Miracles of Mine and my Adler sculpt from um, Ellie's Babies. 
So I am always adding to my collection. And if anyone has any advice on what to look for, scams, things like that. I know several people have approached me on uh, Facebook Messenger. Um, one was trying to sell a Claire Taylor Oh, Claire Taylor doll, which I really liked and would buy, but I didn't, you know, with it being on Facebook. And then she wanted to use the PayPal friends and family, which I did research luckily and, and you know, would, would never do that. So anyway, here is her, this is Reagan's Jockety uh, two-piece outfit here. I don't know if it's too masculine. It was in the girls section and quite frankly, I don't care. I think little girls look good in, um, in some boys boy type clothes too. I think she looks gorgeous there. I think she is sweet. Now I can't find her passy, which I guess she doesn't need. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna, her socks don't match and quite frankly, I can't crawl anymore if I can, but uh, I don't wanna crawl. So anyway, we'll put her here. Um, we'll end this for now. I hope I'm not overwhelming anyone. Again, I'm off for two weeks, so anyone wants to help entertain me you're welcome to i hope to have some subscribers i would feel so good i don't even know how this works if i have it set up to do that um but i'm really looking forward to to doing this and having continuing the discussion and kind of um just you know learning more about the hobby and and collecting so any advice and input is welcome and i can't wait to see you guys again or talk to you guys again thanks